In this video, we're going to take a look at the rule tile asset. We're going to look at how we can use a rule tile asset to define a series of rules on a tile and create a smart tile that adapts to surrounding tiles as we paint in our scene. Although it's fast and easy, painting individual tiles with a tile map can be quite repetitive at times, especially if we want to make changes to lots of tiles. Fortunately, we can create a tile that adapts to our surrounding tiles, meaning that as we paint additional tiles next to an existing tile, the existing tile will update itself to correctly match the surrounding tiles. We can do this with a rule tile asset. The rule tile asset can be found as part of the 2D Extras pack. This pack is a set of custom scripts and behaviors for use with the 2D tile map feature set. Once we've imported the extras pack into our project, let's create a new palette for our rule tile and then create a new rule tile asset. We'll then select a default sprite for the tile and add each of our tile sprites we'd like to define in our rule. Let's then drag the rule tile from the project window into our palette. And if we start to paint, we can see that not much happens, except that our topmost tile is being drawn. This is because we need to define rules for our tile. To do this, we can select inside of the grid sections to define the rule for each sprite in a tile. A cross in the grid dictates that this is a hard edge and an arrow defines a continuation of the tile. As we add rules to this list, we can see that the tile we painted changes to adapt to the surrounding tiles based on the rules we're setting in the inspector. Generally, it's best to place a cross on the edge of the tile and then arrows in the one or two main directions the tile continues from, leaving the rest of the grid blank. It's worth experimenting with this to get the best layout for your tile set, you may also need to rearrange or move tiles up and down in the list to change their priority for the layout. As you can see, once a rule tile is set up, it's extremely flexible and even easier to lay out our levels in 2D. For more information about the tile map features, or to download Unity and try the rule tile yourself, follow the links below. Thanks for watching.